guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a what we eat in a day because I thought that that huh? I didn't know that. Yeah. Well, we're gonna do a what we eat in a day um, and just ignore my chest this whole vlog because I got burned at the beach and now I'm peeling and that's also why I haven't uploaded in like two weeks is because we were at the beach and I just took that time off. But this morning I did make us a green smoothie and I'll show you like making it a little bit right here but I didn't really do the recipe because if you want the recipe you can go check out my last vlog which was a what I eat in a day and I gave you the whole recipe for that. So that's what we had for breakfast and usually I just make a big green smoothie and then I split it between me and Asher so that is what he's having over there for breakfast too. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna show you what we both eat in a day. So I am plant-based, Asher is not. So I figured it would be fun to kind of show like how we both eat living in the same place, one being plant-based, one being not, if that makes sense. So here we go. Asher, you gotta tell us what you're cooking. It doesn't really have a name. It's gonna be mashed potatoes or squash potatoes. Um, and then mm -hmm. pan fried in the skillet. And then I'll probably do like bacon and egg on top of it just because I've never had breakfast. And cheese. Well, you had your greens maybe as like a pre breakfast. Yeah. And you had your cheese on it, did you? Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. So typically, um, I'll make Asher like a smoothie in the morning and I'll have that. Sometimes I'll have like a smoothie and like a breakfast bagel or something too. Um, and then dinner we usually do have because I'll cook dinner. So usually he does eat whatever I cook, which is usually a plant-based recipe. Um, but for lunches is usually whenever he kind of like does his creativity and kind of makes a good meal. So he'll either do like this potato hash thing or he'll do a sandwich. One thing I will say that I try to do is I try to get him like good quality like animal products and stuff if he's eating them. So... For example, like I like to get like the free range pasture raised eggs and stuff, organic. And then same thing with like the meats, I like to get or organic, antibiotic free, same thing with the cheeses and stuff. So I at least try to get him higher quality, that way it is a little bit better for him. We're going on a super secret mission today that we can't tell any of you guys about. Yep. But you'll find out soon enough. So for my lunch today, it's a little bit early. It's only 11.50, but I'm just craving this so bad. So this is the coconut and potato lentil soup. I've showed this on my channel. Maybe maybe I have it. I don't know. Um, but we usually have it a lot during the winter, but me and Ash were both craving it, and it's just, like, amazing. It has carrots, broccoli, celery, zucchini, cauliflower, um, potatoes, lentils. So many good things in it for you. So I love it, and it's very comforting. And I also haven't really been eating that many salads lately. Um, I don't know why. I kind of got out of a little bit of a rut of salads for the moment. And so I'm just kind of going with it. I've been having this and spring rolls pretty much as lunch this week. So this is my lunch right here. A big bowl of this soup. And it is delicious. All right, he's finally done with it. Would you like to care to explain it? Sure. So we start off by boi boiling the potatoes, and then we squashed them, seasoned them, and then fried them in some butter in the pan. And then I drizzled some of my special sauce on there. Special sauce? And then uh, over medium egg. Nice. Good oh, job. Bacon too. <laughs> so I am just making some content back here and stuff, but I am getting a little bit tired and we have to leave here in like an hour um, to go on our secret mission. Um, I'm just calling it that because it's fun, but I need like a little pick me up and I was gonna make an iced coffee, but I'm trying to get better about not drinking so much coffee because I can get really reliant on it really easily. So I am gonna have a kombucha. So I have this Cosmic Cranberry from Synergy. This is like one of my favorite flavors for sure. Asher got it for me yesterday. It was really sweet. Um, I'm only gonna have like half of it though because I really don't want the cool thing right now and that way I'll have some for tomorrow or the next day too. <gasps> well, that one's supposed to happen. Okay, now I'm gonna enjoy this kombucha and continue creating my content. I'm making my brownie recipe right now. If you haven't tried it, it's like my favorite recipe ever. It was actually like the first healthy recipe that I like came up on my own. So it's near and dear to my heart. Um, so yeah, check that out if you haven't. I think it's in my free three day guide. If you wanna check that out, the link, the link for that is in the description box below. 
So we are back at our place now. We were gone a little bit longer than I thought we would be. Um, so I'm just now starting to prep some dinner and I just like cried my eyes out from this onion. Um, so because I am a little bit hungry, it's already six o'clock, I'm just doing something easy tonight. So we're gonna do tacos, um, which really I just use like beans from Thrive Market and little rice packs and stuff so it's super easy um but I did already over here I cut up some onion and mushrooms and then I'm gonna saute those over here just that way we can get in some extra veggies and stuff and then I'm gonna chop up this stuff to have with some toppings and make some guacamole as well too the taco seasoning that I use I got this from an herb store um, back at home but I'm sure you can also get it at like some nicer grocery stores and stuff but it's just some taco seasoning this is from Trader Joe's and it is delicious it's citrusy garlic and it is seriously amazing um, it has a ton of different stuff in it but it's just like limey and garlicky it is so good taco bar set up now so these are the bean packets that i've been using they're just from thrive market they are absolutely delicious i love them um ingredients are very very clean on them so that's great i don't like that it has sunflower oil um but refried beans are kind of just like a treat here and there so all it is is the black beans and the refried oil or in the sunflower oil i'm sorry um and then we have our salsa obviously all of our toppings that you saw me cut up and then i mixed one of these rice packets, these we just buy in bulk from Sam's Club. They're super great. So I mixed one of those with the onions and the mushrooms and then added a little bit more of the seasonings you saw in the beginning. And then I just have our tortillas right here that I toasted each. There we have it. Yummy and delicious taco night, which is honestly one of my favorite nights because it's so easy to make, but it's so delicious. And my face is a little oily. Just ignore that because I'm too lazy to get up and go blot it. But this officially wraps up today's vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed it to see what he eats in a day and what I eat in a day being in the same household and one being plant-based and one being not. Um, if I have dessert tonight, I will show you what it is. I'm not sure if I will, but if you did like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And we will see you in the next video. Say bye. Adios.